uncertain. Today, I'm going to be talking about Sudeen Hilton again. You may remember her. I did a video on her a couple of years back. Well, them killed her recently. When I did a video on her, I tell her to say, and she has started to see the ugly side of badness because things did start to get grimy upon her from them time day. She made the news when they come out of the papers and them say well, she you know she's the first you know, gun woman with them that knowledge says a gun woman. I made a video on it saying well apparently this is the first female 87 in her man of course she wasn't the first female 87 but this was the authorities and basically acknowledged say, yeah, woman actually deep in her badness and deep in her gang life. Viral videos go down because there was a youth named Jimmy who them killed. She played a direct role in that murder. Right. People get catches to people in a car back. People are saying, well, I know Sudi in that. Right. People are saying, then she involved in this, now she did there with how comes. Who don't forget? Remember about the whole 1214 madness? Who don't forget? Who don't can't forget about 12 and them youth already? Remember the Glen Devon case, them and you know, the Mobile madness? But I thought, just in case you forget, that I mean, was enough content drop. Right? It's hard to even remember what was a month ago. I'm going to attach the old Sudan video them. At the end of this video, so you can watch and refresh just in case you remember who Sadeen Hilton is. And that way, I'm have to repeat myself. But from them time there, right, things did spook keep on her. Things did get grimy, then they even tried to kill her from then. I'm telling her, say, right, she has started to see the ugly side of badness, but it turned out she never seen nothing yet. Because I know it get ugly. Both sides of that, man, then kill her. Where yeah, you're over 40 shot. Of course, since then the JC have come out and said, well, she was a known gang member. Man. She was on bail. For the same Jimmy case, she was charged for murder. Judge Gear one million dollar bail. Bail get paid. Touch back the road. People start to celebrate. But I'm telling all the time. Gang members are safer behind bars. Gang badness is not the same as when if you're a man that go down the road and throw on a ketchup in an argument and punch get through and man get injured and get locked up and charged. That a different kettle of fish that from gang badness. In a gang badness, when man get bail, in enemies them rejoice. She was safer behind bars. You now go get bail. If you murder somebody like Jimmy, you now get bail. And the murder charge and just go on about your life. Them boy they will wait three, four years as long as it take. Smaddy I go dead back. These eighty sevens have to get to a point where they must go start to the judge you run a minute one of you. Keep me so. This is gang war. Only thing so because she have a needle eye, they were going to treat her differently. Gangs are the ultimate. All right. Hope to this. When it comes down to equality, when it comes down to treat everybody that's so gangs operate, they not differentiate. Them days are done long time. Right. Man or woman. Right. Somebody are dead back. The streets don't settle things at Privy Council. The streets don't settle things at Privy Council. They know what you do and they kill you back. I'm always surprised she lasts this long. But when I hear it sound like this all get comfortable. Releasing gang members is good news for their enemies. As I said, there's been several attempts to kill her. Especially around about the time of when Jimmy first did. But her luck run out. Of course, when the story of her death drop, uh, we usually go up on the news, people see put up a female shot over 40 times, you know, people are like, oh my god, and this, oh boy, then wicked, and this, and this is the ugly reality of badness. Most time we tell them, 
in a badness. Yeah. When they get involved in a badness, if an police kill you, if an enemy kill you, your friends will. When it comes down to badness, if an police kill you, if an enemy kill you, then your friends will. It's not as fun as they make it out to be. So when people, why the fart is shot on? Young member, bad girl, kerosene. Now you know it work already. If you're a 87, if you're a 90, if you're a gunman and you're not famous, then you, then if you go suck your mama, it's a dead. Right. So there's nobody no way now that I hype them, yeah, if dead. Then people in Jamaica and say, police need to kill them. If they're not famous, and they know them. But if it's a female gunman, if it's, if it's a kerosene, then then 87 must have ignored. Right. We will let them play on the gang apparently as it work. And as it work. They don't care. When people talk about femicide rate and woman woman dead, I tell them so that start is used out of context. If you look on the countries them will have the high femicide rate and the same countries them have the high murder rate because it stands to reason that a country with a high murder rate with enough people are dead, then automatically that will mean enough women are dead because women are people too. Just look on the femicide rate. Jamaica they high up because Jamaica top murder rate. El Salvador they way up because El Salvador top murder rate back in the day. Honduras and them, any country with a high murder rate usually have a high femicide rate. This is basic logic. If God man are kill enough people, then enough women are dead too. They quote that stat with no context. They make it sound like men just go around us. Just looking for these women to just kill because you know the Jamaican men just oh let's find a neck woman for just randomly kill. Because they hate women so much. If anything, Jamaican man get tech food for woman. If you could measure being tech for fool by a woman, if you could measure it as a number, Jamaican man will up there too. But Jamaican man get jacket, like how dolphin get water splash man in back. The Iron Man is a notorious sim, but that's just how the thing go. If you actually check the data and check the facts, you will see that in the whole world, Jamaica is one of the two or three countries where you're most likely to have a female boss. The Jamaican female is more educated than the Jamaican male. The Jamaican female make up the majority of the population and they're the minority of murder victims. But none of this is adding up. It's the Jamaican male, it's the young Jamaican male who is the one who is in danger. But nobody cares about men. Nobody cares about boys. They're disposable. As me telling you, so they never have a Carlton. So they never have a man who... Love her and check for her and people are saying, boy, good one. Guess what? Get dash one side. Good man in Chihole. 87 in Chihole. One of them. Because them say, man, them say the man, they were involved in a badness and the man, they not do this and the man, they carry themselves certain way. Them say the man, they boring. No one, they man, they. The man, they not trendy. The bad not sing about them, man. They. If I hear a song say, I call it in a low mix Japan, you've never heard that in your life. 87 in Chihole, she like that. Well, we see how this has ended. Cast our life. One of the most dangerous things about the kerosene is that you can't even spot them easily. Like 87 stand to have a general look where the old and carry themselves about the kerosene. You can't spot me telling them to say, no for our favorite corporate dolly them. From the NCB to the Scotia to the Lasco. To the ATL Automotive, I right, talk about high heels and walk around speaking and spoken. Gunman in she hold to. Them telling us it's because all oh, because of the suffering and they need they need the 87 to provide food. Woman them are mind the gunman them. Them tell us all oh, what you need to be educated and make six figures. Cut it out. That I went time she had go up in her age. But when I breast them stiff like the blue mountain peaks, at them time they you might catch her on a lorry stand. I screech you out a sci fi yard. Three o'clock in the morning. You can't even sleep in peace, cause when you're in your bed and you hear plop, 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 plop. That's a shootout and a shootout and a gunshot, a box shot. Look on the picture, so you look like a normal woman. I never know. 
police and describe us on the first gun woman they acknowledge as a gun woman. You might, if you see her up on the roadside in distress, they'll pull over and say, Oh, you want to help, sis Chain? That even though sir, probably low, she'll lower your feet, man, and come out. I bush come take you, yeah. Take your vehicle and chop you up and fling away. Never to be seen again. Boy, right, rough. But people have to accept. But this life really come with. If I'm an enemy, if I'm a police, are your friend them. Somebody I get you. That's so badness though. You just have to pick and choose who you sorry for. That's the only thing I yeah, saw. So. Anyway, Patreon Squad, big up on yourself. PIA, you don't know, more life. Ultra Squad, stay circling. Bless.